So I am Loïc Trompet. I work for the Belgian Institute for Space Aeronomy and I will present uh, NOMAD instruments. Uh, so it's a spectrometer suite selected as part of the ExoMars Suez Gas Orbit mission. Uh, NOMAD stands for Nadir and Occultation for Mars Discovery. So it's a compact high resolution uh, three spectrometer mission, uh, three spectrometer channel. Um, it consists uh, of a dual infrared channel coupled to a highly miniaturized UV visible channel. Uh, the SO channel, uh, SO stands for, Nadi uh, for solar occultation, uh, is a copy of the SOAR uh, instrument that was developed for the uh, Venus Express mission. Um, uh, the LNO is also a copy of the SWAR instrument, um, but it's improved for uh, lower light levels, um, so it's uh, able to make nadir and solar occultation. UVC is also uh, able to make nadir and solar occultations. Um, as you know, uh, the TGO has a wide, uh, as many uh, uh, science objectives, um, and uh, NOMAD uh, will improve the characterization of the chemical composition of uh, the Martian atmosphere by uh, detecting a broad uh, suite of trace gases and uh, key isotopes. Um, so as we, as, as we have seen, um, NOMAD has a spectral range between UV and infrared. Uh, so it will detect uh, all the uh, gases and their uh, isotope uh, logs. Um, NOMAD will also improve uh, our knowledge of the climatology on Mars, and it will also improve uh, our knowledge of the possible source and things, uh, which could be a photochemical process, or a dust and or ice-related process, such as uh, tree boil electricity or uh, releases from the polar ices. Um, uh, NOMAD. Uh, will generate a, a large amount of um, data because uh, we can do nadir observation whenever we want and uh, in addition to solar occultation and uh, solar occultation that, that can be done at sunset and sunrise. So, okay. Thank you for your attention. Thank you.